Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Chief Ozzy. Welcome back to another Clash Bounce video. Okay, so today we're going to be checking out a new challenge that has come out. So if you recall, um, last challenge was the Epic Winter Challenge, which was like, I think during December. And now they come out with a new challenge, which is the Hog Mountain Challenge. So today we're going to be checking it out and see what the base is like. I haven't really seen the base yet. So here it is. There's like 11 days to do this challenge. And it gives you 400 uh, XP, 15 gems, and 2 builder potions. Not bad. The uh, experience is definitely worth it. Gems, not so much, but builder potions are always nice. So we're going to go ahead and attack this base and see what it has. I don't know. Um, I, ju I don't have a strategy yet, so I'm just checking out for first time impressions. So if we don't restart the space, I do apologize. I definitely will try to come up with a strategy in the next video. Okay, so let's see. So looking at this base, it's definitely maxed out. It's like Town Hall 13 um, with many cannons and a bunch of wizard towers. So there's like four Inferno Towers, all single target in the corners of the center. And then in the center, it looks like you got... Is that a clan castle? I don't know. That could be a clan castle. Okay. So let's try to deploy a hog here. Um, oh, it is a clan castle. Okay. That is quite interesting. Okay, so then let's go and lure out. Oh, okay. So there's an electro dragon um, and a bunch of other things in this clan castle. Okay, so there's a bomb too. Um, oh my gosh. Alright, so, oh my gosh, let's go ahead and buy another hog rider, oh my god, okay, so there's a golden dragon in there as well, alright, um, oh my, okay, so we're gonna have to lure these things out, it's not gonna be easy here, uh, let's see, where do I lure this thing to, okay, let's go ahead and, I think we could, okay, I'm gonna be strategic here, where do I put my Bourbon King? Can't put it down there. Okay. So is it out of range here? Let's put our Bourbon King here. And that way, okay. So I'm going to deploy my healers so they can um, freeze the dragon. Alright. Shoot. Okay. What? I didn't freeze the dragon. What the hell? Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I think we messed up. Okay, so we already lost our queen. This is gonna be difficult. Um, yeah, we lost our queen. This is not good. Can we? All right, we're gonna restart because uh, that was bad. Okay, so first of all, this base is extremely hard, just like the epic winter challenge. Not easy at all. And I don't think I'll be able to have 3-star in this episode. So I'm just going to go ahead and try it. But at least now we know what's inside the clan castle. And we got to get rid of the clan castle if we're going to proceed forward. Um, yeah. Okay, so let's go ahead and deploy another Haw Rider. Um, I don't know. Okay, so let's see. Can we get... I don't know if we're going to be able to get all of these... Um, troops out. So let's deploy another hog raider. Oh, no, not here. Okay. Oh, it doesn't learn all the troops. Okay, I see. Alright, we're gonna have to deploy hog raider. Oh, more. Okay. Yeah, the clan castle learning is gonna be really difficult. Let's go and start over. Yeah, so you have unlimited attempts, so we don't have to worry about, um, Limited how many times we mess up because it's unlimited. So let's go and deploy. I could uh, Where can I deploy it? Let's deploy it here and oh, there's giant bombs. Did not see that Okay, we can't go over there. So where else can we go? Let's try over here All right, and then yeah, it's taking a lot of hog raiders. <sighs> okay, we gotta... Okay, first thing is, we gotta kill that golden dragon. That's the first thing we're gonna have to do 
in order to three star this base because unless we kill the golden dragon i'm pretty sure this base will be um impossible like borderline impossible to beat without killing the golden dragon yeah so if we can get rid of the golden dragon that will be our first biggest task uh, we gotta do that but first of all let me see if i can just at least get a one star on this okay so that's out um if we start attacking the town hall directly okay so at least the queen's gonna do some work here hopefully she doesn't get in range of oh dang it all right we're gonna go ahead and freeze this and freeze that and yeah we're gonna at least try to get the one star here just for the sake of it okay so we got one star and it looks like you can only get gold from this base there's no elixir whatsoever okay i see all right let's go and try again okay we're gonna try one more time to attack this base i'm not gonna drag out this video too long because i don't have a strategy to beat this base at all um i just found, found out just later t just a couple minutes ago about this so that's why i'm pretty much unprepared but anyway this is just my first overall impressions um really overall extremely strong base and um there's level five in the level five walls in the center but that doesn't matter the town hall is on the edge so if you want if you can get like two stars or higher and three stars you can at least get the one star the first time the good news about this is is that it gives you the troops that you need to beat it you just gotta come up with the strategy for it so i'm gonna have to do that offline and uh yeah in the next video i'll definitely um show you how to beat this base it may take time though because uh, this will not be easy. So yeah, I, this is pretty much for everyone. So if you're new to Clash of Clans, you can definitely do this. I highly recommend checking out guides though, because this will not be easy for anybody. Um, that's just the truth here. Okay, so on with the attack. Um, yeah, these Inferno Towers are really annoying. Uh, I can hardly... Okay, so let's try this. I'm going to try freezing... Uh, these defenses and then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let out the troops and uh, let's go and freeze these as well okay I'm uh, gonna go ahead and do that okay so we are able to let out the troops okay good so I guess freezing it worked um, hopefully that doesn't come back to haunt me in this raid and then we need to lure them what can we lure these things we need to lure them somewhere we can kill them okay so let's go ahead and deploy our queen here and uh, see if we can oh shoot that didn't work out too well okay all right so gonna go ahead and deploy my healers and uh oh my gosh okay Ooh, yeah i don't know if this is gonna work okay and the air defense is activating shoot 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 okay all right so i guess that's gonna be enough i'm gonna yeah, I'm going to come up with a strategy to beat this base. Um, there's just no way I can do this without any planning. The only reason why I did this without any planning is because I want to show you guys the base and what it was like. But overall, a really challenging base, and I think this is going to be a lot of fun to decimate. So good luck to all you players out there. Um, I will have a video out on this on how to beat it. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to make it by tonight. I don't think so because it's late night from where I'm recording. But yeah. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, overall, uh, really fun base. And uh, yeah, I'll definitely make another video on this. So stay tuned for that. And uh, yeah, I'll see you all next time. Peace out.